I want to preach now about an unpopular subject that is called the Lake of Fire. I don't know whether you've heard of it, but Isaiah 33 verse 14, The sinners in Zion are afraid, for their fearfulness hath surprised the hypocrites. Who among us shall dwell with a devouring fire? Who among us shall dwell with everlasting burnings? We need to ask ourselves this question. You see, we're in great danger without faith in Christ, without having the Lord Jesus Christ as our Saviour. Matthew 18, verse 8, Wherefore, if thy hand or thy foot offend thee, cut them off, and cast them from thee, it is better for thee to enter into life halt or maimed, rather than having two hands or two feet to be cast into everlasting fire. In other words, don't let anything hold you back from having your sins forgiven and obtaining everlasting life through faith in Christ. Uh, Matthew 25, 41, Then uh, shall he say, that's the Lord Jesus Christ, also unto them on the left hand, Depart from me, ye cursed, into everlasting fire, prepared for the devil and his angels. See, God doesn't want any of us to go to the lake of fire. He's made the provision for you and for me that we would be saved. And that's why I'm preaching concerning the lake of fire, to warn you to flee from the wrath which is to come. The thought of getting a job and being like a normal human being, get a job and be a, a help to the country. I do have a job. Well, yes, the Lord Jesus Christ died on the cross so that you and I could be born again into God's family through faith in the Lord Jesus Christ. And if we leave this earth without Christ as our Saviour, we will be in hell. Now, I'm here to warn you today because many people think that maybe this is a joke. It's not. It's deadly serious. So... Um, Revelation of Jesus Christ, chapter 20 and verse 11. And I saw a great white throne, and him that sat on it, from whose face the earth and the heaven fled away, and there was found no place for them. And I saw the dead, small and great, stand before God, and the books were open. And another book was opened, which is the book of life. And the dead were judged out of those things which were written in the books according to their works. And the sea gave up the dead which were in it, and death and hell delivered up the dead which were in them. And they were judged every man according to their works. And death and hell were cast into the lake of fire. This is the second death. And whosoever was not found written in the book of life was cast into the lake of fire. Revelation of Jesus Christ, chapter 21 and verse 8. But the fearful and unbelieving and the abominable and murderers and whoremongers, that's fornicators and sorcerers and idolaters and all liars shall have their part in the lake which burneth with fine brimstone, which is the second death. And as I said, there's no need to go in to hell when you die and then be cast into the lake of fire where there's weeping and wailing and gnashing of teeth for all eternity. God has made the provision for you and I to have eternal life. And this eternal life is found in the person of the Lord Jesus Christ. That's why the Bible says, He that hath the Son hath life. He that hath not the Son of God hath not life. Do you have the Son of God? Have you believed on Him for your eternal salvation? No need to die and go down to hell and be in the judgment of God. Your soul can be saved as a result of faith in the Lord Jesus Christ. So be warned. We're all on a journey to eternity. But where will I be? Where will I be five seconds after I die? Will I be in heaven through faith in Christ alone? Or will I be down in hell because I've rejected or neglected God's only offer of salvation through His dear Son, the Lord Jesus Christ, who He sent into the world to save sinners? Christ Jesus came into the world to save sinners. He said, I came not to judge the world, but to save the world. I wonder, where do you stand as far as God's salvation is concerned? Are you saved? Are you a child of God through faith in Christ? Or are you still not in God's family? We need to be born into God's family through the Lord Jesus Christ.
Okay. I love um, the Lord. I'm, I'm Catholic. Are you Catholic? Yeah. No, I'm not actually. Oh, oh you're not? No, no. no we're both Catholic. We're all Catholic. Yeah. Well, the point is, religion can't save us, girls. That's the whole point. That's true. You know what I mean? It's only Christ. That's why the Bible says, Wait, he that so hath the Son. What religion are you? I'm just a Christian. Oh, okay. Christian. No yeah. denomination whatsoever. Yeah, you know? I, I'd never take this cross off me like this one here. Oh, yeah. I've worn yeah. it like since I was 12 years old. It's never come off. Oh, yeah. Because yeah. I'm a child of God. We are all children of We're God. We wouldn't say die hard Catholic. We wouldn't say. Yeah. Um, you gonna? But we yeah. all believe we'll go to heaven. Well, the, the word of God says, for we are all the children of God through faith in Christ Jesus. Yeah. So you've got to receive him as your saviour, you know what I mean? Yeah. You've got to come in repentance toward God. Now that means a change of mind. Yeah. It's simply coming to God and agreeing with him. Like, Wait, I are you doing against all these? Against what? Like, is this why you're here? Because you don't want, like, all these, like... Oh, yeah, yeah, that's right. I'm very yeah. concerned about school. Yeah. Well, well, everyone, like, but I mean, well, because, just, because there's multitudes of people here, more than normal, yeah. that's why I'm here, because I'm very concerned well, about you people. Like, okay, I mean, so you're trying to convince us yeah. like, to be like good, um, but we're, tr we're here to convince you like that you need to God trust us like to, yeah. to like do what we do. Like we wouldn't do it if God like repented, you know what I mean? Yeah, but yeah. but you know, I mean, all um, all entertainment is not sin. You know, all yeah. enjoyment yeah. is not sin, but some of it is. Like we're looking at drunkenness, fornication, okay, oh, yeah. sodomy, mm -hmm. all these okay. things. I think drunkenness you know. is okay. Yeah, well, God doesn't but say that. But not very much. No, yeah, God didn't. I've read the Bible many times, yeah. but like a bit, like a drug and like all that. Ob yes, very much, and like fornication. Yes, but not. Yeah. yeah. Mm. I mean, let's face it. That's why most young people are here. For. Look, let's be honest. Yeah. Well, that's what we're Fornication, here for. But we're drugs, still good Catholic. Good, you like, know, I go to church alcohol. like every Sunday in Sydney. Yeah. I yeah. don't know where there's it. Where's the closest church here? Because we'll go on next Sunday. Oh, I don't know. I, so I don't you don't even really. go to church. I, I go to meetings, Christian meetings. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Down at um, Burley Heads, actually. Oh yeah. Um, five Anzac Parade, Burley yeah. Heads. Yeah. But the main thing is that we've come in repentance toward God and faith toward the Lord Jesus Christ. So that's that's what it's all about, you know. Yeah. If we if we live our lives just but enjoying right. ourselves and just at the end of the day, we're yeah. going to go to hell. And that's what I'm yeah, preaching okay. about, you know. Yeah. It's judgment ahead for those who leave without Christ. Wait, but can I ask you a question? Yeah. Do you get drunk? No, I don't, because I don't drink. But do you drink red, red wine? Do I drink red wine? Yeah. Well, Jesus drank the wine. At the, yeah. at the Lord's Supper I do. You know, when I remember the Lord Jesus Christ, when he, you know, that's like a... So you get drunk. Little, you do. Yes, you know, do. I, you I, do. I, I don't get drunk. Ah, we get no, drunk. I don't get drunk. No, no. no, I have a sip. Because that is the, the, an the emblem. The blood of Christ. Well, it, it's not actually his blood. Have you blood, had your Holy I mean, Communion? Holy Communion? What's yeah. that? Like Catholic. Like oh, he's bread. Christian though. Oh, yeah. yeah, look. Are you Anglican? No, I'm not Anglican. Like I said, there's no denomination. I just believe Christ died for me and I've received him as my sa yeah. saviour. Well, then we I'm have, going to heaven. You know in the Catholic, like, yeah. when you, um, like, take the bread of Christ and the blood yeah. of Christ. Bread. The bread, yeah. Like yeah. The, the Holy Communion, like the little circle of wafer. Yeah. Yeah, yeah so that, that, you don't do that. We do, but not the circle of wafer. We, we have a, a loaf of bread, which is broken, oh, and then we have a little yeah. bit of that when hey, it's passed Jura. around. But, yeah. that's for, yeah. but that's for Christians, you know, that's when you're saved, when you're born again into God's family yeah. through faith in God. It's got nothing to do with going to heaven. Wait, so Only how do you think that we can get to heaven? Well, by repentance toward God and faith toward so our like, God. So like reconciliation? Yeah, it is reconciliation, but it's through the blood of Christ. Yeah. You know what I mean? It's through his precious shed blood that he shed hey, on the but cross. So if his we want to go away. to heaven yeah. and we want to take the blood of Christ, which is the red wine, so that means girls who are 17 need to take the blood of, wine, the blood of Christ. So that's got nothing to do with getting to heaven. But that's what you just said. Hang no, on. no, 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 hang on. Yeah. The shedding of his blood on the cross oh, hang on. I'm just getting has got, phone call. Has got on, everything wait. to do with yeah. getting to heaven. No. But right. taking wine and wafers and whatever, that doesn't get us to heaven. Yeah. That's, that's not, you know, it's faith in Christ alone. That, that's what gets us to heaven yeah. because Christ has done the work on the cross because he, 
He died for our sins, then he yeah. was buried, and he rose again the third day. Is that a camera? Yeah, yeah. What's that for? It's for putting videos on YouTube. Oh, so congratulations. Can we, can we be on you'll, it? You'll be on it. We really love Jesus you'll be on Christ. It. Like, I wear this cross every day of my life. Alright, thanks for that. Fine. Thanks for everything. What's That's your right. channel called? Um, Peace by Jesus Christ. I'll give you... Oh, thank you. Thank you. I'll, thank you. Yeah, I'll, I'll give you a bit different one, but uh, yeah. Oh, I get it. Thank, thank you. So Thanks for you know, look me up if you much. want to on YouTube. And, and praise be the Lord. Yeah. Have a good day. Anyway. Yeah. See you later. Thanks.